Types of Generator The generators are classified into two types. AC generators, DC generators. AC generators AC generators are also called as alternators. AC generators works on the principle of Faraday's law of electromagnetic induction. It is the most important means of producing electrical power in many of the places. Working of an AC generator When the armature rotates between the poles of the magnet upon an axis perpendicular to the magnetic field, the flux which links with the armature changes continuously. Due to this, an EMF is induced in the armature. This produces an electric current through the galvanometer and the slip rings and brushes. The galvanometer swings between the positive and negative values. This indicates that there is an alternating current flowing through the galvanometer. AC generator has two types. Induction generator, synchronous generator. Induction Generator The induction generator requires no separate DC excitation, regulator controls, frequency control, or governor. This concept takes place when conductor coils turn in a magnetic field actuating a current and a voltage. The generators should run at a consistent speed to convey a stable AC voltage even no load is accessible. Synchronous Generator Synchronous generators are large size generators mainly used in power plants. Synchronous generators are of two types. Rotating Field Type Rotating armature type Rotating field type The rotating field alternator has a stationary armature winding and a rotating field winding. The advantage of having a stationary armature winding is that the generated voltage can be connected directly to the load. A rotating armature requires slip rings and brushes to conduct the current from the armature to the load. The armature, brushes, and slip rings are difficult to insulate, and arcovers and short circuits can result at high voltages. For this reason, high voltage alternators are usually of the rotating field type. Rotating Armature Type In Rotating Armature Type, armature is at rotor and field is at stator. Rotor armature current is taken through slip rings and brushes. These are limited due to high wind losses. These are used for low power output applications. Rotating field type of alternator is widely used because of high power generation capability and absence of slip rings and brushes. AC generator can be either two-phase or three-phase generators. Two-phase alternator 
A two-phase alternator produces two completely separate voltages. Each voltage may be considered as a single-phase voltage. Each generated voltage is completely independent of the other. Three-phase alternator The three-phase alternator has three single-phase windings spaced such that the voltage induced in any one phase is displaced by 120 degree from the other two. These can be connected either by delta or Y connections. These generators are packaged with an engine or turbine to be used as a motor generator set and used in applications like naval, oil and gas extraction, mining machinery, wind power plants etc. Delta Connection In Delta Connection each coil end is connected together to form a closed loop. A Delta Connection appears like the Greek letter Delta. Y Connection In Y Connection one end of each coil connected together and the other end of each coil left open for external connections. A Y connection appears as the letter Y. Advantages of AC Generator These generators are generally maintenance-free, because of absence of brushes. Easily step up and step down through transformers. Transmission link size might be thinner because of step-up feature. Size of the generator relatively smaller than DC machine. Losses are relatively less than DC machine. These generator breakers are relatively smaller than DC breakers.